guys welcome back to my channel my name is asia if you are new here please hit that subscribe button and join the family if you like this video press that like also turn on your notification bell so you know every time i post a video Whew! so today i'm going to be talking about eight ways you can always look good i mean who doesn't want to look good so Today I'm just giving you a few tips to, you know, boost up your confidence a little bit and make sure you always pop in, you know? So first thing is shower and wash your face, and brush your teeth and get fresh. You don't want to be walking around with crust all in your eyes. Also put on lotion. You don't want to walk around ashy. You want to look fresh. You want to look clean. That's the first step. Second step, when you are picking out your outfits, okay? You're picking out your outfits. Iron them. Iron them. I cannot stand walking around, seeing people with wrinkles all in their clothes. It doesn't matter if it's a t-shirt. don't matter if it's a nice shirt. Iron it. You're going to look like you just rolled out of bed. And I know you don't want to do that. Iron your clothes so that you look sleek and put together. The next step is to wear things that fit your body. Don't wear things that are too baggy. So like if your shirt is baggy and your pants are baggy, you're gonna look like you just don't care. So wear something, if you do wear a baggy shirt, which sometimes, you know, that's kind of cute. Like this top is very flowy. Wear something tight at the bottom so that it gives you a shape and you don't look like you just, just ain't put together. What I say, fourth step. Fourth step is, I would say accessories. Accessories are, what make an outfit you could be wearing a t-shirt and jeans and if you put on um accessories like just some simple hoops and some like dainty necklaces and some and a purse that will build up your outfit and make it look like you put some effort into it but less is more okay less is more don't be wearing this big old necklace with these big old earrings and this just big old purse like that's you're gonna look like you try too hard and you're gonna look a little weird wear something simple if you want a big necklace wear some studs or like dainty earrings if you want to wear like big hoops like I'm wearing today <laughs> um put on a dainty necklace that will balance out the accessories that you have my fifth step I said this before in my other video, but um, my fifth step is do your nails. Do your nails. I do your nails and your toes. Toes too. Especially when you're wearing sandals. You don't want to have your toes not done and you're sitting here wearing heels, I mean open toed heels and some sandals and your feet look all crusty and like not cute. Don't don't do it. Do your toes and your nails look cute. I will say some people don't like to have their nails painted, so you don't have to have your nails or toes painted, but at least have a pedicure and manicure, manicure done so that your nails look at least clean. Like your nails underneath are clean, they're like the cuticles are down, they're pushed back, your nails are shaped right. Like you want to at least look put together as far as your nails and your toes. The sixth step is makeup now makeup is an option i know some people rock that natural beauty that's why you need to wash your face and clean your face and stuff that so that and put lotion on so that you can rock actually look cute and rock that natural look but those who do wear makeup don't put too much on okay some of y'all be walking around with some crazy makeup where it looks bad okay it looks like you're a clown please don't do that to yourself you're embarrassing yourself watch youtube videos get to know how to do things like your eyebrows or your eyeshadow start small start small do natural makeup first and then slowly get to know how i mean slowly learn how to do more makeup like colorful looks so start with like the browns and stuff and then move up to like the colorful like like yellow and blues and browns i mean not browns reds and pinks and stuff like that so also if you are just beginning and you want to wear makeup and you want to look put ah, i can't talk and you want to look put together for like work or an interview or something like that i would do this three-step makeup thing that um makeup 
routine that I do whenever I'm in a rush, which is brows, mascara, and lip gloss. Brows, mascara, and lip gloss. Sometimes I do eyeliner too, just because I I like wearing eyeliner with my mascara, but that's an option. But brows, mascara, and lip gloss will make you look put together. One, it'll keep your lips moisturized and it keeps it from looking ashy and, you know, your brows, I mean, well, I'm going to say mascara first. Mascara, like, makes your lashes look longer and makes your eyes pop more. But also, with brows, it shapes your face. It really does. Have you ever seen those, like, before and afters where um, somebody's doing a routine, like you watch a routine, brow routine video, and they show you what they look like before and then after, and it looks like a whole nother person a little bit? Because they did their brows. Do your brows. It will make you look so cute um, and put together, too. Like, it, it, you just will look cute, okay? The next step is hair. That's number seven, hair. Personally, when I don't do my hair, I, I don't look great, okay? I don't look put together at all. I look a hot mess. But do your hair. Do your edges especially. Any type of look that you do, do your edges because it will make your hair look even better and more put together and more sleek if you don't know any type of hairstyles um i would recommend doing a bun like i do my buns i like buns they just they're quick easy um especially for interviews it makes you look put together and not you trying to do too much especially when you know you're trying to look professional i recommend doing a slick bun whether it's a high bun a low bun either way you any type of bun you want i would do that and make sure you use gel so that it's slicked and put down I'll also try i it's hard for me to trust me i do this all the time try not to use too many bobby pins because you don't want to have them like all over the back of your head try to do get a nice gel and hit the top of the short hair so that you're maybe using two and it makes it look like better and get a scarf a silk scarf right after you do your gel and your brow um not brows and your edges put it on like like that and then tie it and wear it right after you do it and don't take it off until it's dry it will be down for a couple hours trust me it works all the time the last step the eighth step is to be confident no matter what you're wearing, no matter what you look like, no matter if you did your makeup or not, if you don't have self-love and self-confidence, it will show and you won't even feel like you look good. So other people won't think you look good. If you walk around here like you, you're all this and that and you show them that, hey, I'm confident and all this, people will realize that, hey, she does look good. I want to look that way too. And then, you know, just you being confident and having that self-love will make you look good any day. Yeah, you guys, this is the end of my video. Um, I hope you got some tips out of this. I hope this helped you. And I hope that you do this, like you use some of these tips. And if you do, if you already use these tips, put them down below. Let me know that you use them. If you have any other type of tips, put them down below for other people to read also. But, um, oh, and the last thing that I really want to say. If you see me wearing this, this outfit in another video, it's because I have to work next week. So I'm probably not going to be able to film. So I'm going to be filming like a few videos today. So if you see me in this other this outfit don't put it in the comments i know i can clearly see that i'm wearing the exact same outfit but you know i want to get these videos out for you guys to watch um while you well you ain't got nothing to do or when you just want to watch youtube i want to put these out for you so so yeah thank you for watching this video and uh yeah bye guys